And now, your Storm Team 18 forecast, weather from where you live. All right, an interesting setup this morning. We have much cooler temperatures to the southwest. That's closer to the main area of low pressure. I'll show you that with radar in just a second. We're below freezing, 31 Crawfordsville, 32 Attica, Fowler 33, 34 Kentland. Kentland received about a half an inch. Fowler, Oral Park picked up about one to two inches of snow last night and in through very early this morning. Uh, so that's where we'll see areas with that may have some sick spots where we have snow on the ground, untreated roadways, bridges, overpasses may be slick, but otherwise we're in the up mid to uh, lower 30s. 33 Delphi, 33 Flora. Good morning up in Rochester. Our warm spot at 36 degrees. So there's that low. It's going to continue to move southward. And with this low, the very cold air is in place aloft. And that's what's helping give way to some snow showers. And I was looking at some uh, in dot uh, snow plow cameras snowing in Vetersburg right now. Take a closer look. Most of us will all dry a few areas of drizzle, maybe some light patchy fog here and there. But otherwise we are starting to get most of the precipitation out and you can see kind of what we'll call downstream where everything's coming from from the northeast. We're not seeing as much precipitation, so that's good news zooming in here, but we can see some snow showers along 74 southern portions of uh, Fountain Warren counties seeing that western portions of Montgomery County. So we're traveling 74 be aware maybe some uh, whiteout conditions, but overall things are kind of on the downward trend with the snow and rain and that's pointed out here with future cast will stay mostly cloudy this morning. This is 10 o'clock and here comes a cold front a week one, but it's going to give way to maybe a few light showers, maybe a flurry mixed in, but I think temperatures will be warm enough to keep this all as just some light rain coming in this afternoon into the early evening hours. This is six o'clock tonight. Once we get past nine, the rain should start to move out and we'll stay with cloudy skies tomorrow morning. But I do believe once we get toward the afternoon, we'll get the sun out for your Saturday. 41 degrees for the three o'clock hour. Just areas of patchy fog, some drizzle this morning, uh, but otherwise uh, we'll be fairly clear uh, other than overcast conditions. It'll be just a soggy day with those rain showers by three and six. Now tonight we'll get down to the lower 30s with maybe some areas of patchy fog. We should be dry tomorrow. Maybe some drizzle in the morning. Sun by 343. So let's get to Saturday with future cast. Note the nice clear skies that we'll see by the afternoon. We'll work up to the lower 40s, but then we'll see a little bit more clouds coming in Sunday afternoon, New Year's Eve, and then maybe some snow. If you're traveling northbound, you'll have the better chance for snow but some flurries for us Sunday night into early Monday morning and then a clear kind of quiet week for next week. So for New Year's night, hour by hour for 2024, we're going to be seeing just isolated drizzle, maybe some flurries throughout the evening. Impacts to roadways should be minimal, but will be quite cool out there, lower 30s and upper 20s. So 39 for a high Sunday, 37 for the start of 2024 on Monday, and then just a quiet week with highs upper 30s to low 40s overnight lows pretty cold mid 20s but really as far as rain or snow goes i think we will be going to get back here at <laughs> these 10 day forecasts really the next of the week pretty quiet with highs in the 40s going into the 50s possibly going into next weekend all righty so we're seeing that influx again with mm -hmm. those higher temps for today though we will look ahead with the the rain and the snowy mix, yes. whatever that is. <laughs> it's just going to be a gloomy day today for sure. But yeah, getting into next week looks like we'll warm up. But I think mid January, late January, I think that's when we're expecting possibly cold shots of air, maybe more snow. Alrighty, thanks so much, David. Oh, yeah.